And here we go. Welcome back. It's Ipsy Bag Day. And I have no idea why it took so long to get to get to me. It ships literally an hour away from me. And it took a week. It took a week to get to me. That's ridiculous. Come on, Ipsy. I know you can't control the post office, but there's something, there's something. Anyway. Here's the book. It's like an actual, like, book. I think I follow him on Instagram. I don't know what his name is, but Ipsy Cash. And it has a whole bunch of stuff in here. Huh. Okay, so that's what we got for the book. Let's get the bag. Oh, I got something out of the bag, too. <gasps> I got the bag I wanted. There were, a few, uh, there were a few variations, but good vibes only. I love this. Is This color is my jam. I love it. And then it, like, ombres up to, like, a periwinkle blue with a little gold tassel. I love, I really like this bag. I got a little bit of a smudge on the back, but I think that's super cute. I am definitely going to use that. Here's what I have in my hand. It is a brush from Crown. Crown brush, whoops. That's all that it says, what does it say in here? It just is, it just says Crown on it. So it's a nice little, pretty basic, probably foundation brush. Maybe a contour, maybe a blush. It's pretty just good all, all rounder brush. Let me pull my drawer out so I don't lose stuff and let's get into the inside. First thing, yay, black mascara or black uh, eyeliner. Liquid, liquid coal waterproof liquid liner. Hmm. I am not going to open this up because I have about 25 black eyeliners. So I am not going to open it. I may put it in a giveaway. I may keep it for my nieces. I don't know, but I won't use this because I have so many other ones that I have. I just do. I mean, how long does it take you to go through an eyeliner? I don't wear eyeliner a lot, and I don't have a ton. Aurora and Ipsy. What is this? Pro Cover Up Concealer, Balmy Beige. This looks really, really dark. Look how yellow that looks on my skin. Um, so I'm not going to open this to swatch it either. Um, you know what? Let's swatch it, because I'll probably just give it to my mom. Um... Oh yeah, that's yellow. So my mom has a little bit more of a of a warm undertone, like she's a little bit more yellowy than I am. Um, so I'll just give this to her. She likes she likes when I do that because she doesn't ever buy anything on her own. So, uh, yeah, I think the the concealer I got from. From Sephora was better. The Kat Von D. I just got this. Um, it's just a little thing that's just like, hey, we're awesome. Sorry, that doesn't look very good. There we go. All right. Whatever. Email that to me. I don't need to have a piece of paper in my bag. I'm just going to throw it away. Super hydrating eye cream from Air Repair. Let's see. Oh, it's thick. Sometimes eye creams are like, yeah, super moisturizing, and then they're like not thick at all. So it's it's a pretty uh, normal, normal whatever eye cream. It's not anything crazy, but I always keep a stack of eye cream things. So when I run out, I have another one. Ooh. Ooh, Ico London Black Magic Mascara Drama and Curl. 
I think I may have, excuse me, I think I may have tried this way, 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 way long ago. So I'm pretty excited to have another one. That's what the tube looks like. It's an actual tube. It's a little warm. Oh, curved brush. Might have to squish it a little bit more. I see the product didn't go all the way up the um, up the wand. But I'm excited to try it. I love mascara samples. I do. I do, I do, I do. Oh, there we go. There, I got it all covered now. That's going to be interesting. I'm definitely going to try that. I'll probably wear it tomorrow. Um, so that's all that I got. That's pretty good. I... I think I went back through my, my Ipsy profile after last month, and of course it was before this month went out, um, to take off all of the eyeliners. I love eyeliner, even though I don't wear it every single day. I, I love eyeliners, especially like, I have a, like purple and grays and stuff like that. I love that. But if all I'm going to get is black eyeliner, I don't want any more. I don't want any black eyeliner, so I'm gonna, I took that off of my profile. And I think I might do the concealers too, just because it just seems like they just throw in whatever. And even though I'm, skin tones are so different and it's such a vast variety. You can be fair, but you can be cool, neutral, or warm tone, or a mix of whatever. And all the way through, fair to very deep you just everybody is so different and if they just have a sample that they're going to toss in like this one i would rather have a mascara fantastic concealer i won't use i'm gonna give that to my mom eye creams great i like that just because some other um facial products like lotions especially for me make me break out so if i'm just doing something here i don't ever knock on wood I, d I don't break out here I'm not gonna hopefully one day wake up with a big zit right there because of an eye cream that I use but anything else that I use around here can make me break out so eye creams great black eyeliner I'm done with it I'm done oh I just noticed the zipper is pink Oh, I really, oh I'm digging the colors of this bag and I got a brush I would love it if I got a brush every single month because when I first started, it's really soft too. I don't know what I'm going to use it for. Probably that looks like a good, a good contour brush for me. Um, when I first started in this whole makeup thing, I just bought a cheap set of brushes from Amazon. And as a, my boxes have been continually coming and I've been digging, like having all these subscription boxes, I've built up quite a good collection of, of brushes. So if I get a brush every single month and I can start replacing the cheaper Amazon ones that were like, I got like 20 brushes for like $12 or something like that. So if I can start replacing some of those, especially since they are starting to break down, I've had to re-glue my contour brush. <laughs> so... I, I'll dig it. If I can get a, a brush, that's worth the $10 to me every single month. So that's what I got. I love the bag this month. A couple of this things work. So, so they're still good things. So if you wanted a black line liner, or if you're starting out and you haven't built up a, a collection like I have, it's great. Then you can play with a liquid felt tip liner or a regular liner or whatever. The concealer shade is just too yellow, too yellow for me. I think it would it would make me look really like sallow and tired underneath my eyes. Like I need a like a brightening, um, a light a light brightening under eye concealer. So, other than that, there's still good products. I still don't feel like I wasted my money. Ipsy still is bringing it. I'm comparing it to the Macy's box, so I don't think I'd ever get rid of Sephora Play. I don't think I, I don't see myself ever doing that. Um, so. Good job, Ipsy. I dig it. Thank you guys so much for watching. I really appreciate it. We hit 500 subscribers. I'm still waiting on my one thing. So, I got one of them, but I'm still waiting on something else. So, but you guys know, since we've done two other giveaways, I will get that video up as soon as I have all the things so you can see everything. And we'll do a giveaway video. So, thank you guys so much for watching. I really appreciate it. Subscribe down below. I do lots of unboxings. And I will see you guys next time. Bye.